One of the challenging problem about mass spectrometry is that when you have elements that form diatomic molecules. For instance, we have bromine. It's known to form diatomic molecules. Two forms of isotopes of bromine are bromine-79 and bromine-81, and they exist as one-to-one -one ratio. That means half of it is going to be bromine-79, and then half of it is going to be bromine-81. Determine how many peaks in the mass spectrometer. We know that each individual isotopes of bromine, bromine-79, and bromine-81 will have their own peaks, so we have two already. Now, because bromine forms diatomic molecules, two isotopes will combine in different possible combinations to form more peaks. Then we have 79 and 81. If we look at 79, 79, bromine 79 will combine with bromine 79 and give us one more peak, which is at what? 158. Or we can have 81 combined with 81, bromine 81 and bromine 81 combined together, give us one more peak, 162. Or lastly, we can have 79 plus 81 combined together, give us 160. One unique property is about this is that because bromine 79 and bromine 81 exist as one to one ratio, you can say that if they combine together, they would have twice the height in their peak comparing to the one that is combined by 81 or 81 or 79 and 79. So give us a total of five peaks right here.